What's good, my lovelies? I am back from my little trip. And I want to see what's going on with Earth signs. What's good, Earth signs? Taurus, Little Capricorn. Let's see what's going on for y'all. We have the Rebel deck right now. We're going to see what's happening. Spirit, can you show me what is it that Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn need to know, please? Your body is pissed at you, it says, okay? Um, get the fuck outside, move your ass, okay? So there could be something health-wise, okay, um, going on with you right now. Stop fucking whining, okay? No one wants to listen to that shit. Complaining makes you weak. You have the strength to change your world, so do it, right? And it may be that you're feeling under the weather. You're feeling a little low energy right now. Um, but we're going to take a look at what's going on, all right? Something could have happened. Maybe a little bit of depression. Let's take a look. Spirit, can you show me what's going on with Tur Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn, please? I almost said Tur Turgo. <laughs> Taurus, Virgo. So you might be uh, both a Taurus and a Virgo. Spirit, can you show me? That's the Ten of Pentacles at the bottom of the deck. Okay, you have the Seven of Swords out here, okay? And I heard, keep lying to the top, okay? So there might be something you're not wanting to look at right now. With the Five of Wands coming out cross, it feels like you're avoiding a conflict, or you'd like to, or you might feel like somebody's avoiding something that needs to be discussed. Now, you have the Page of Cups out here. Maybe that somebody owes you an apology that they have not given, or maybe you owe an apology that you have not given. The Two of Wands is out here. So it feels like a decision is coming in regards to that. And the Page of Pentacles is at the bottom of the deck. So there's going to be an opportunity to smooth something out here. Okay, whether you want to do that is another story. You got the strength card. You're feeling a little stubborn right now. Okay, and you've also got the Ten of Wands. Something is uh, weighing heavy on you with the Page of Cups. Again, okay, so it feels like there is something going on here. That is uh, pulling on your frequency. We are going to clarify these really quickly. Spirit, can you show me why the Seven of Swords is out here for my Taurus, Virgo, and Capricorn gang? My Earth signs, please. Why is the Seven of Swords out here, please? You got um, Dr. Grant, which is Virgo with the Ten of Pentacles, okay? So there could be something about a contract or somebody that you've been partnering with that you're wondering if you should be doing something on your own financially. Okay, maybe you feel like you're being financially drained or something isn't a wise investment. Okay, you've got the five of wands out here crossed, like I said. <clears throat> and it's coming out with the three of swords. Okay, so there's something def definitely weighing on you. And there's a conflict that you are trying to rise out of, but you may feel like there's no good alternatives. I feel like this is draining your energy. You got the five of cups out here next. Spirit, why is this five of cups here? Five of cups is coming out with the ten of swords. So you may feel like all that you've given to a situation, it's all for nothing because... Uh, you know, something didn't come out the way you wanted it to, or it could have felt like a bad investment. With the two of wands and the six of baskets, you're wondering if something can be saved or something can be salvaged, okay? Strength, a strength card is out here as well. Spirit, why is this strength card here? With the two of pentacles and the, the four of baskets, okay? So I feel like you are standing 10 toes down on something and with the two of pentacles you're trying to figure out what the right course of action is without actually making a decision at the moment and i feel like the reason is because four of cups you feel like maybe there's not great options okay six of wands okay you may feel like the victory is out of reach okay with the seven of baskets like it's illusionary like every time you you get there you feel like um it's almost there, but it's not, right? 4.44 on the clock when I said that, okay? Ten of Wands comes out with the Three of Baskets. 
So there could be too many people in this situation, but I'm feeling like some type of event, something that maybe you took on an investment or something didn't work out how you wanted it, okay? But it was done out of love with the Ten of Cups at the bottom of the deck and the world and the Ace of Pentacles and the Two of Sticks. So it feels like... You shouldn't get discouraged by short-term results because you've got a lot of positive cards at the bottom of the deck, right? You had the Ten of Pentacles twice, and it feels like you might be expecting results too soon, okay? With the Page of Cups, you have the Nine of Swords, okay, and the Six of Knives, all right, with the Emperor at the bottom of the deck. So this feels like... You want more progress than what you're actually seeing. But Spirit is asking you with this page of uh, cups and the seven of swords, are you putting enough work in for the star, for the direction that you want to head in, right? Your North Star, right? With justice here to bring yourself the justice that you deserve, right? Or are you just feeling shortchanged, okay, because you want the future now? Got to give it to you straight. I'm a Taurus too. Could be speaking to me, right? So, you know, there's this thing about wanting things to happen sooner than they're actually happening. I'm going to look at the money deck just because, you know, it did feel like this had something to do with some type of investment. So we're going to take a look real quick. Sir, can you show me what's going on with Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, money? Science coming out crossed, Okay. Writer, the past, unfulfilled, and unlocking. Okay, so something with this science card coming out crossed, all the others came up straight. It makes me feel like something in your formula, something like you missed something. Okay, and um, with the writer, I feel like you need to use a lot of lists right now. Okay, for like the steps that you took in the past, what could you have possibly skipped over that left this thing unfulfilled or not with the uh, advancement that you wanted? Okay, because you have unlocking here. I feel like you're going to get another chance at that. And with a student, okay, I feel like there you, you can take a class or learn more about that uh, said area. Okay, and offering, okay, work smart, okay? So I feel like um, you're getting another stab at it, okay? And it feels like Spirit's saying meet, uh, meet your manifestation, like rise to the level of what you want to see is what you need to be putting out. Okay, something could be draining your energy, and I feel like it's the lack of seeing forward progress, okay? Uh, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, I feel like you shouldn't worry. You just need to stay focused and stay forward thinking and, and, and stop, um, like, giving yourself negative juju by having like a negative nancy attitude okay so that's what i got for you guys i'd just like to say thank you for spending a little time with me blessings on blessings bye